afternoon, this afternoon I'm doing a cooking presentation with my apprentice Michelle. And what are you cooking? Craig's curry. curry. Craig's curry. Father's famous curry. Curry in a hurry. Ah, very good. All right. Well, we'll uh, make a little segment about this, will we? Father's cooking show or something? Oh, very good. What's the first step? Put it in a saucepan, in a pot. Okay. For rice. For rice. All right. So, Father, you yes, put the water in the saucepan. Yeah. What was that sneaky little ingredient? This is garlic. Um, mm. I prefer fresh, but mince is good. It's garlic. Handy for camping because it's Handy nice and quick and easy. And uh, Michelle's working on something over there. If you... you don't peel the sponge like that, Bob. Are you allowed to do a Gordon Ramsay? If you want it. <laughs> Or the curry. In a hurry. I will cut chicken. Oh, very good. So, Father, we didn't mention our latest purchase on the old Ziggy there. It's a um, two tiered trivet. I can't show you because it's red hot now. I should have showed you well before. Well, we'll come in for the zoom. Look at that. Look at that. So, it turns the Ziggy into a two burner stove. And this one awesome drops idea. down. Michelle will show you. She picks the rice right up. See how yeah. that is a dropped down one? Lovely. And this one is flat. Yep. So if you've got a Ziggy, yeah. recommend the trivet. It's been great. We've been Excellent. doing a lot of cooking outside. So as you can see, Father is chopping up the chicken and popping it into a bowl, ready for his curry in a hurry. And Michelle on the other end there is dicing up some white potato. Father, what do you normally put in instead of white potato? Sweet we've... potato, but we've got someone who's allergic to the cinnamon in the vegetable, so we have to use normal potato. So we can obviously improvise. Uh, improvise. <laughs> we've got Imp an edge of my cake in them. We do, and they both help taste just as good. So we've cut up the potato and the chicken. So the next step, oh look at that, nice cutting, look at that. <laughs> so the on. next step, pan on. on. Yep. Open them, Mother Man. Oop, Mother Man, let's have a look, oh, show the people at home what we got. Yeah. Can Pour we see it. the label? No, you're not allowed to show the label. There we go, oh, whoops, we don't provide it. <laughs> <laughs> this is not a sponsored video. <laughs> <laughs> Mother Man. In the pan, in the pan. Mm -hmm. The whole, all that, the whole all jar. That, yeah, whole oh, jar. okay. Yeah. How long do you cook it off for, Dad? Well, normally two minutes on a gas stove, but this one's a bit slow, so probably 15 minutes. Right. <laughs> <laughs> till it's ready. Cook till ready. Till it, yeah. til it starts till it's to simmer. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I can smell that already. Lovely. Pity it's not smell a vision. Stirring, Michelle. Oh, oh, it can smell like that. Ooh, yum, yum, yum. I'm going to shake this because this is coconut cream. And if you don't shake it, sometimes it's a solid block and you get a little dribble of cream. So I'm going to shake it and make it a little lovely. Let's take it off the heat. Alright, rice is boiling. Yeah. Heat. And rest. Now that's the absorption rice. method. Yeah. Righto, chicken going in. Oh, we're going to have a big enough pan. Of course we will. No. Here we go. And it's a good way to wash your hands, this is. I did wash them, promise. I <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know. We might not have a big enough pan. Oh, now we don't have a can. Oh, chicken cooks, yeah? Yeah, what a chicken cooks. Right, oh. Tainer's got to go in now. We did um, maybe prepare a little bit too much for the chicken, so now we're in two pans. Yeah. And then we're going to pour that in. Okay. Coconut coconut milk. So is this coconut cream or yeah. milk? No cream. And two tins. So this would normally serve four, wouldn't it? Yeah. But this is probably going to serve at least six. Because we 
we went pretty heavy with the chicken and the potatoes. To use it all up, we can have leftovers, which will be yummy. Mm -hmm. Where's your stubby hole? Oh, it's in the bed. Okay. Yeah, we the chicken. And the potatoes. And the potatoes and the coconut cream. And just let it simmer now until the potatoes are cooked. Very good. And Michelle, what are we having with the curry? Naan bread and roti bread. Ooh, yum. Well, we're just going to let that simmer away. We'll go and uh, yep. have a bit of a happy hour while we wait. And we'll be oh. back. Thank you. Well, happy hour has now concluded. And the grand reveal is now on. Where's the rice? In the other one. Ooh. Hang on, I've got a fluffy, fluffy. Fluff the rice. We have an intruder. That'd be Jeff. Nose on him like a horse. Mm. What do you reckon, Jeff? Smell alright? That flies are going to me straight like the last one. <laughs> <laughs> so, here's the rice. Get him fluffed. I mentioned the absorption method. It's got to be fluffed. Beautifully. You need to fluff it with a fork. Beautiful. Alright, so basically, now cool. it's time to dish it up. Good Very job, Apprentice. You did well. Yeah. And to finish it off, we have beautiful roti bread four ways. So what was it? Oven? Oven, toasted and frying pan. Look at that. A feast for legends. Good job everybody.